Well, we have been moving around quite a bit here in the Dayton area, and as we do, we just see more and more damage. Here's a couple of commercial buildings. That one has uh, some damage, and this one has very heavy damage. I have no idea what kind of business this is, but uh, the building there is very heavily damaged. One of the, uh, the more interesting sites that we've seen is uh, over here. This is a, a warehouse where there's, uh, they distribute Frito-Lay chips, and uh, you can let's take a look at the parking lot and we'll show you what we've seen in this parking lot. Here's a couple of trucks on their side. Uh, some of these other vans have been blown into the other vans. Here's another one that wound up completely upside down as the uh, powerful uh, winds, a tornado, if it was indeed a tornado, that came through this area. So not only is it neighborhoods and homes, but dozens and dozens of commercial uh, properties and businesses as well. Right across the street, another neighborhood that looks like it is a war zone. I described an apartment complex earlier as looking like a war zone, but you look at this and you see the heavy damage to some of these homes, some of these homes uh, with minor damage, other ones completely leveled. And again, neighbor helping neighbor. We've seen a lot of that going on today. People coming out and helping their neighbors uh, try and clear debris, trying to clear the roads so uh, cars can get through. Uh, here's a neighbor that, uh, that might be a contractor already working on patching the holes in, uh, in the roof of that particular home. So the devastation is everywhere throughout the Dayton area, north of Dayton, uh, to the east and to the west of Dayton. And it looks like this uh, tornado actually took a little bit of an easterly uh, to the southeast path when normally we see tornadoes go to the northeast from the southwest to the northeast, but that doesn't seem to have been the case with this one. So here's a, a, some more homes that uh, are heavily damaged right across the street from those uh, commercial buildings that we just showed you. So uh, a lot of work uh, remains to be done here in the Dayton area for life to get back to normal. I'm Dan Carroll in Chopper 9.